All right, so many of you ever shared a confidential message with someone else? <coughs> or maybe you've worried about someone else sharing your private message. So the trend was social. You've seen Facebook, you've seen Twitter, and a million other startups work to broadcast your message to as many people as possible. Now the trend is moving in the opposite direction. It's moving towards privacy. So here are a couple of the very popular privacy apps. Um, Snapchat, every kid on campus is pretty much using this. Um, the adults might not know about it. You send disappearing pictures. Um, they were offered $3 billion by Facebook, even though they haven't made a penny of revenue. And uh, there's some other players in this space raising a lot of venture capital funding right now. So why is this space so popular? And by ephemeral messaging, I mean messages that disappear after you read them. Um, basically, ephemeral messaging combines the best of both worlds, in-person and digital communication. So it gives you the comfort of an in-person conversation, which is temporary, private. You know they can't, they're not recording the conversation. They can't show it to someone else. Well, at the same time, you retain what's good about a digital conversation, which is that you're hiding behind a screen. Everyone's more comfortable behind the screen. So with that, I'd like to introduce my startup, Glimpse Messenger, and I'm going to show you why Glimpse is better than everything else on the market. Okay, so why is Glimpse better? First and foremost, you can't take a screenshot of a Glimpse. If you take a screenshot, you get about half a word, and then we can actually shut the rest of the message down. So it's impossible to take a screenshot of the message. Second, you can't read the message and then show it to someone sitting next to you. This is the problem with every other app out there, is you can easily read the message, and even if it has a self-destruct timer, you could just show it to the person next to you. Um, and lastly, you don't have to set that self-destruct timer. So as you're writing a message, how do you know how long to set a timer for? You don't know how quickly a person reads. Glimpse takes care of all that for you because the person reading the message sets their reading speed when they sign up for the app. Um, lastly, if you have an iPhone, I invite you to pull it out right now, go on the App Store, search for Glimpse Messenger. It's a free app. Um, you can try it out and you can see what you think. That's it. All right.